what is going on guys today we're going to be doing a tutorial on the plugin called quest so this is how to set up quest for your minecraft server it's a very simple plugin not very complex but there are four types of quests that you can possibly set up with this plugin so if it sounds interesting go ahead and download it drop in your plugins folder and then restart your server let's go ahead and get started so a quest is a challenge that a player is given and when they complete the quest they will receive a reward so you can set any reward that you want this is also all in a gui which makes it very user friendly for your players and there's four types of quests mining which is breaking blocks building placing blocks mob killing which is killing animals and monsters or player killing so those are four types of quests. You can set as many quests as you want. But with that being said, let's go ahead and open up the quest UI with slash Q. We have four quests. And also another interesting thing is there are certain lot quests that will be locked until they complete the previous quest that is needed to unlock it. So we have four available ones, which is block break one, block place one, coal miner one, and ice skater one. So in the lore, it'll tell you how many blocks you have and how many you have to do, and then the rewards. And also, obviously, we'll tell you the description of the quest. So to complete it, you must mine 10 of any block. So that's really easy. Let's go ahead and take on the challenge real quick. So click on that, and then it tells us that we have started the quest. So let's go ahead and get out a pickaxe. And then here we go. So I went ahead and broke one. And a cool thing is, if we go back to the quest UI, it'll have the enchanting effect on a quest that is currently active. And it'll also obviously update the progress inside of the lore. So we have one out of 10 blocks. Let's go ahead and break four more. So there's three, four, and we should have five. So slash Q again, five out of 10. All right, so let's go ahead and finish it. One, two, three, four, five. Bam, in the title, it'll say quest completed, the name of the quest. And now we have $500 more than we had before. So that is pretty freaking awesome. Let's go ahead and try another quest before we create our own. The cool thing is this quest unlocked a new one called Block Break 2. And it obviously has more of a higher reward and more to do. So we have to break 100 blocks instead of 10. But now let's go ahead and complete something a little bit more difficult. How about Mob Kill 1? We must kill 10 of any mob. There we go. We started a new quest. All right. So let's go ahead and slay a lot of mobs. This is going to take quite a bit. So we got one two three let's make sure it's updating yep three out of ten mobs killed let's go ahead and kill seven more four five six and seven eight nine and Ten. There we go. Quest completed. Now we have eight hundred more dollars. So this is obviously going to make it a lot of fun for your players to be doing quests on and off. And hopefully you guys can create a lot of quests for your players. But let's go ahead and create our own now. So here we go inside the config. You'll see the quests that have already been created. Um, there's certain features to each quest, like if it's redoable, the cooldown for it. Obviously, if it's redoable, it will have a cooldown. The value, which is like, let's say it's a mining one, the value to complete the quest is 10. So 10 blocks need to be mined in order to complete the quest. All right, so we have quite a bit. Let's go ahead and create our own. So honestly, for this player kill two one, which is kill 25 players and receive $5,000, I would make that a lot higher. It's not really high at all. We can go ahead and also change the quest title and messages that we get. Will we complete one or just we except one you can change all the messages for that but like i said guys let's go ahead and create our own let's go ahead and use a block breaking all right so the thing with this is you can create a general quest like placing 100 of any block breaking 50 of any block but if you want to do it for a certain block then keep in mind you're going to need this type right here so mining certain colon and then the block id or placing certain colon and the block ID. So now with that being said, let's go ahead and create a new one which will be based on mining. So let's copy the format of that with control C, enter a new line backspace all the way and then paste it in. So now we have this, let's change the name of this, let's call it Diamond Expert. There we go and this will be a mining certain and obviously it will be Diamond Ore which is the ID 56 and then if it's redoable or not, we'll go with sure, so true. Cool down, we'll have to make that true as well. 
30 minutes let's just make that 60 minutes value so how many they'll have to break let's go with let's go with 20 since it is called expert we can make like diamond beginner maybe five so we can make a lot of quests and now we change this so we can make it diamond underscore or this is just what item appears in the gui to represent the quest change the display name to diamond expert and actually 20 seems quite a bit, so I'm just gonna get three for the purpose of this video. If I was really creating the quest, I'd make it a lot higher. But let's go ahead and make this mine three of diamond ore rewards. Let's make this $10,000. And then here is the reward. So type command, value, and then the command itself. So, so slash eco give the player variable. So depending on what player completes it, it'll give them this amount of money. Let's change this to 10 thousand there we go all right so let's go ahead and save that restart a server and let's see the quest and also quickly i forgot to change that so the progress shows that i only need to complete three blocks all right so back on the server if we type slash q we should be able to see the diamond ore block which is right there um with the texture pack i'm using it appears to be like a red block sorry about that but it is a diamond ore and the quest is diamond expert it appears right there so it says to complete this quest you must mine three of diamond ore we get ten thousand dollars and so let's go ahead and take on this quest so here are three diamond blocks again with the texture pack you can't really tell we mine two open it back up and then chain effect is there and it says two out of three blocks and then there we go so we now got ten thousand dollars for completing that custom quest that we just created so hopefully you guys did enjoy this plugin tutorial this is an awesome plugin make sure to download it download the link in the description make sure to drop a like subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in my next video peace out